Welcome back everyone to Let's Play Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker. Uh, this is actually weeks after the last recording and I haven't like edited all of that yet. Um, sorry about that, but it really doesn't um, make much of a difference to be honest. It's not going to hold back uh, how, how fast I get this Let's Play done. Uh, too much anyway. Anyway, so in this episode we're doing a bunch of side quests yet again. Uh, as you can see, I did grind for rupees. Basically, you just go to the uh, rings of light uh, that randomly appear on the sea. You just go there. It's it's a uh, that that's all you need to do. Oh shit! I need to fucking take care of you, don't I? Ugh. Hold on. I'll kill you. Hold on a minute. There you go. There you go, buddy. Anyway, so we saw this in the beginning of the Let's Play, pretty much. Um, this little island here, you pass by it on your way first time going to Dragon Roost Island. But, I, could, I didn't want to do that this yet, because I pretty much couldn't. So, I'm going to go in here. There we go. Put your sword away, you dumb bitch. Um, can you crouch? It wasn't, like... What the hell? I can't crouch. What the hell? Oh, man. There we go. Okay. Sometimes I... Like, I have a... Wireless controller. Which has been working for, like, a decade now. But, uh... Sometimes I just need to turn it off, turn it back on. Hopefully, it doesn't get any worse than that. Because, honestly, that's not that bad, but... You know. Oh, now It's you... And it's you. So yeah, this is a small little mini dungeon here. Uh, the only thing you need for this mini dungeon to get through it all the way is bombs, so... Yeah. Give me that jelly. Mm. By the way, I got a... A blue... Uh, shit. Blue choo-choo jelly off screen. While I was grinding, it was on an island we've already been to, so... Uh... I think when I... If I... Ever, like... Deliver the blue chew jellies, I'll just give you a list of all the islands that have it. So that way, you know where it is without me showing you. I don't want... Like, I don't think anyone really even cares about that, to be honest. Die. You fuck! Oh, you again, huh? Die! Why are there so many of these things? Yeah, those... Those blue... Stalactites on the ceiling, like... Are some of them chew jellies? What? I don't know. Anyway. Oh, hi! Oh, hi! Oh, hi! I think this is the thing we got came here for. It's a heart piece! Mm. Well, we got two of them. Two pieces of heart. So that's interesting. I don't know where the other ones are. Anyway, I think I'm gonna go deeper into here, see what's here. There might be something worth my while. I know there's not another heart piece, that's for sure, but... And I know there's not like a... Oh, this is the last chest. I know there's not a treasure chart. Okay, yeah, I'll take that. That's pretty good. Anyway, see you guys later. Bye bye. Just worthless enemies. Alright then. Alright then! Alright, well, that's it for this island. Uh, the other heart piece that's in this sector is from a treasure chart, so. Uh, I'll be back here in the, uh, video that shows all of that off. Where's the, uh, fish? I'm looking for the fish. Have you seen the fish? There it is. All the way back there. Alright, well, I'll, I'm gonna get this off screen, and I'll see you at the next island that we go to. Ooh, there's a submarine here. Alright, I guess I'll go check that out. So we're at here at Flight Control Platform. 
And this fish is about to tell us where that is, so I don't have to explain it. Alright. Um, so there are three things to get here. One's a heart piece. One's a chart. An uh, island's heart chart. And a platform chart. And I think the uh, submarine has one of those charts. I don't know. And I think the other chart's at the bottom of the ocean. Who can say, young lad? Who can say? What the fuck is right there? What is that? Is that a light ring in the ocean or... Alright, I can't... It's like so pixely and... Like... It just... It was hard to tell what that was. Uh, I can't see. Alright. This is not a good sign. Uh-oh. Um... Oh, you, uh, I was worried there for a minute. Who would have thought? Uh-huh. Two hits. Two hits for those guys. Just two. What? What? You think you're tough, you son of a bitch? Fucking god damn it. Okay, this is getting annoying here. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. God damn it. No. Stop with the. Stop! Stop! I'm only one hand! Will you target the right fucking enemy? Oh my god. There we go. Jesus Christ. It's just because they stay up in the air, that's the main issue. God damn it. I missed. Uh, uh, there we go. Christ. Just the most annoying fucking enemies. Those toucan wizards and the the the, the small moblin things. Anyway. This better be good. I'm gonna be mad. I swear, if it's like a joy pendant, that would be so funny. Alright, the platform chart. Uh huh. Alright, so the island hearts chart is at the bottom of the ocean, so a treasure chart leads there. So, which basically means that it's kind of worthless, because by the time I get there, I probably would have had all the heart pieces. If that's even what it points to. Cause I I don't know. All right, uh, I'll see you over at the main platform. All right, uh, that was kind of a worthless cut. That was only like five seconds, but whatever. Um. So, what be here? It seems as if this is a mini game, fellas. All right, we have. Uh, all the magic we need, so... Let's talk to this guy. Greetings, O person who has surely come to take the challenge of the big sky. This is where you can register for the official Rito Tribe Birdman Contest. And now, listen. You are free to use any means, methods, or tools you have at your disposal to help you soar through the sky. The rules are simple. See how far you can fly before you crash into the rolling seas like so much dead weight driftwood. A banner stands now at the site where the great and talented champion who has flown the farthest to date crashed into the frothy waves in a massive splash of glory. If you are able to pass that flag, then you will be the new champion, and you will be drenched in praise, much as you will be drenched in seawater. The participation fee is a mere ten rupees. Well, will you take the challenge? Yes. Okay, then at up the ladder you go, my brother always to the top. Uh, I don't see I have wings or feathers on your back, so do you, you do have something that you can use to fly, right? I sure hope so. Here's wishing the winds. All right. So basically, you use your leaf for this. Huh, it's at night. Hey, you have Waluigi's mustache. Oh, a challenger. The contest is afoot. You see the banners? Yeah, I get it. 
Alright, let's break these pots here. So they supply you with magic. Uh, plenty of magic. <laughs> Alright. What you want to do is... Make the wind blow in the right way, of course. Now this is a tip... Uh, typically, it's very hard to do this. Particular minigame, because... You only have so much magic, and you can just crash into the sea, so... Here's hoping for the best. What you want to do is aim yourself towards these tornado things. And, uh, if you miss one, you're pretty much done, boy. You're pretty much done. Ah, oh, shit, I missed one. God damn it. God damn it. I can still do it. I can still- fuck! Shit! Okay. Sploosh! Flight distance was 98 yards. Yes, a whopping 98 yards. Ugh. Let's try it again. Let's go! Here we go. Here we go. So this tornado pretty much restricts itself to the left. Alright, here we go. Alright, yes. All right, we can't miss this one, fellas. We can't miss it. Ah, uh, okay, okay, that's good enough for me. Shit, uh, I might run out of magic. Let's hope not. Fuck, please don't run out of magic. I have enough height. No. Ah, uh, did I make it? Did I make it? Goal! Yes! Woo! Holy shit! Your current record is an impressive 259 yards! Oh, breathtaking! You have shown an incredible feat of aerial navigation. My eyes, they are unworthy. Holy shit! I did it! Amazing! You blew past my brother's best record in impressive fashion. You would make a fine and distinguished member of the Rito tribe, I guarantee it. The former champion upstairs says so too. You are both great and talented. So as the new champion of the Birdman contest, please accept this great and talented prize. Wow! Yes! Yes! Uh, can you fill out my magic? Really? You're not gonna fill out my magic? You're a dick, sir. You are a dick. I want magic. I need it. I need magic. Because I used all of it. Anyway. Uh, we have some time left, so let's go ahead and do another one, shall we? Uh, what is northwest? Well, let's go see what's at the northwest. Wait, did I already... Uh, yeah, I did. Never mind. Sorry for this menu navigation bullshit. Oh no, I need to uh, cruise out of here. Oh no. Alright. I'll see you guys over at the next island. Alright, we're here. Uh, I'm just gonna get some... <clears throat> get the map fish out here. Yes. Yes. Alright, so this is at the upper rightmost corner uh, of the map. So, I, I'm trying to figure out, like, what is here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. Keep talking, buddy. I'm not even, like, looking at the screen right now. Where is the goddamn... This fucking, like, piece of shit. Alright, whatever. I guess we'll just figure out what's here on our own because the strategy guide fails to let me know maybe there's just nothing here who, who even knows that's a definite possibility because there is one island where there's just absolutely nothing so let's find out Ugh, god damn it all right get over here 
Give me this. Yes. There we go. Alright. I was hoping the boats didn't shoot us out of the air. Oh my god! Holy shit! <laughs> I didn't expect you, man. I kind of just, like, used the sword on a whim. Uh... Okay, there's a hole. Well, what's up here? Before we go in. Pretty much nothing, alright. A little magic. That's good. Looks like we're going in a little mini dungeon then. Isn't that rot? Isn't that rot? Alright. Stop that, you stupid butt. Oh, it's like... It is just a mini dungeon. It's a gauntlet thing. Alright. Well, I like these, so... Guess we're in luck. Oh, great. I hate these fucking things. Okay, uh... That was stupid of me to not get my bombs out. What? Excuse me? Alright, hopefully I got one of them. Oh, okay. I don't know how that happened just there. Okay, there we go. Alright then. That was a little awkward. But we're fine. We're fine. We're, we made it out alive, so... That's whatever. Let's see here. Yeah. Alright, one down. A few more to go. Yes, yes. I don't know what's here. I don't know the prize for this. Oh, fucking hell. Come on. Ah, uh, come on. Die, die, die. Yes. He's gonna reform, isn't he? Yep. Well, guess what? It's too bad. Because you're gonna die. That's right. Like, these things aren't even a problem once you figure out that you can use bombs. Just blow them to hell. Thank you for this. I need the magic, definitely. Because that flight control platform is a ripoff! Even though I got a heart piece out of it. By the way, uh, the ambiance here, really love it. Really love the uh, music they put here. I, I'm just a sucker for this kind of tranquil music. Like, is it even called music? I think so. In my opinion, yes. Whatever. You guys are all hiding in pots and shit. Who cares, even? Guys, you died in like, in like three hits. It the, you can't scare me. Give me your uh, joy pendant. So I can sell them. To someone. There we go. Think your shield is good? Haha. -ha. Alright then. Um. And the last door. Here we go. Ah! Uh, fuck off, you two. God damn it. Alright, whatever. I fucking hate these things, I really do. God damn it. Could have killed him right there. Fuck! Stop! Stop with these enemies, man! No, no, stop with the L-Target bullshit! Ah! Ah, oh, I hate this! God damn it. I fucking hate these things, man. God, ah! What does it take? Fuck. Stop L-Targeting. Because the L-Target is worthless. It really is. It 
absolutely. Just kill him, kill him. Yes! Fuck. Oh, yeah. There we go. Fucking hell. That was, like, those always stress me out. I tell you what. Just the worst. Huh? Oh, okay. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, four of them. Oh no. Just. No, oh, no. How are we gonna do this? Okay, well. Ow. Fuck. Alright, alright, alright. I got two of them at the same time with that. What the fuck? I launched him! What the hell? That doesn't even make sense. Alright, there we go. Alright, but all of them have their helmets off. Maybe I can do this. There we go! Okay, okay, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Ow! Damn it. Okay, so now that they're all, like, defenseless for, for the most part, they're going to have problems with killing each other. Which is beautiful. Look at that. Like, they're pretty much killing each other. Look, they're all just dying now. That... You guys suck at teamwork. Give me that. Definitely want that. Come on. You wanna go? Ow! Fuck! Alright. There we go. Man, that was easy. That was easier than I thought. I only lost two hearts. Alright. Now then, use these to break down these, because typically there's a lot of rupees in them. Alright. Give me these. Yes. Yes! Ooh! Oh my goodness! See, there were like 50 rupees in there! There's a lot- there was a lot more than that. But whatever. Anyway, I want this, because... You can sell those for a high price. I'll buy it at a high price. All right. Uh. So. Uh. Which door was it? Is this one? Yes. Now there's a lot of rupees in these things too. Good God. Give me all of that. Yes. Alright. Just play this song. There you go. Do 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 it's a Triforce chart! So this is the first thing of, like, many that we've seen. Holy shit. Uh, the Triforce charts are your next goal for the plot, as I think I explained a, long, a while ago. Basically, you just need to get a few of these, then get Tingle to translate them, and then get Triforce pieces. And we're gonna get those, all of them, obviously. But anyway, next time on Let's Play Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker, we're going to be exploring some more islands. See you guys then.